Hi guys, it's Bags and President Ross. Today we are reviewing a election map between Donald Trump and Kamala Harris, starting with Washington with 12 electoral votes. It is blue for Kamala Harris. Oregon with eight electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. California with 54 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Alaska, which is on the bottom left, is red for Donald Trump with three electoral votes. Montana, which is at the very top, slightly to the right, with four electoral votes, is red for Donald Trump. Idaho, to the bottom left of Montana, with four electoral votes, is red for Donald Trump. Nevada, to the left of Idaho, is brown, which is a toss-up. It has six electoral votes. It could go either to Donald Trump or Kamala Harris. Arizona, to the bottom right of it, with 11 electoral votes, is brown. It is a toss-up between Kamala Harris and Donald J. Trump. Utah, right above it, with six electoral votes, is red for Donald Trump. Wyoming, which is right above Utah, with three electoral votes, is red for Donald Trump. Colorado, with 10 electoral votes, is blue for Kamala Harris. New Mexico, with five electoral votes, is blue for Kamala Harris. Texas, with 40 electoral votes, is heavy red for Donald Trump. It is slightly turning pink, but we're going to keep it red because Trump has won it every single time. Now we're going up to North Dakota with three electoral votes is red for Donald Trump. South Dakota with three electoral votes is red for Donald Trump. Nebraska is red for Donald Trump. Kansas with six electoral votes is red for Donald Trump. Oklahoma with seven electoral votes is red for Donald Trump. Minnesota to the top right is blue for tampon, I mean uh, Kamala Harris. Uh, <laughs> sorry, Iowa with six electoral votes is red for Donald Trump. Missouri with 10 electoral votes is red for Donald Trump. Arkansas with six electoral votes is red for Donald Trump. Louisiana with eight electoral votes is red for Donald Trump. Wisconsin is pink. It is a toss-up state. It could go either for Donald Trump or Kamala Harris. Illinois, with 19 electoral votes, is blue for Kamala Harris. Now we're going to have a red and brown wave coming up. We have Indiana, with 11 electoral votes, is red for Donald Trump. Kentucky, with eight electoral votes, is red for Donald Trump. Ohio, with 17 electoral votes, is red for Donald Trump. Tennessee, with 11 electoral votes, is red for Donald Trump. Mississippi, MS, with six electoral votes, is red for Donald Trump. Alabama, with nine electoral votes, is red for Donald Trump. Georgia, with 16 GA, electoral votes is brown. It is a toss-up state that can go between Kamala and Donald Trump. Michigan up at the top with 15 is brown. It is a battleground state and Donald Trump needs to win Michigan in one of his three pathways to victory to the presidential seat. Florida with 30 electoral votes is once again heavy red instead of pink for Donald Trump. South Carolina, with nine electoral votes, is red for Donald Trump. North Carolina is pink, with 16 electoral votes. It could go either to Kamala or Donald Trump, but is leaning heavily Donald Trump as of now. Virginia, VA, with 13 electoral votes, is blue for Kamala and Tampontin. West Virginia, currently now, with four electoral votes, is red for Donald Trump. Pennsylvania with 19 electoral votes is brown, which is a toss up between Kamala and Donald Trump. So he has to win Pennsylvania 
in order to have one of his three pathways to victory leading to the presidential seat. Or she has to win it in one of her five pathways to victory to the presidential seat. New York with 28 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris and tampons in. Connecticut, Rhode Island, and the rest are blue for Kamala and Tampon Tim. But Maine, M-E, is red for Donald Trump. Hawaii, the bottom left with four electoral votes, is blue for Kamala Harris. And the rest of the districts that aren't marked in Nebraska, it's just safe to assume, can go either way. This is an updated electoral map of the 2024 election. Donald Trump winning with 309 electoral votes and Kamala Harris losing with 220 electoral votes. If you like these kind of videos, like, share, and subscribe, and also check out KK's Innovative Perspectives on YouTube. She's doing election videos also, shorts and long form, and trying to take off. Thank you all. Who do you think is going to win, baby? Trump. I think Kamala's going to win.